Hey everyone, so I'm going to go over the Google reCAPTCHA demo in this video. So the first step is just to make sure this extension is installed from the marketplace. Once you have it installed, you'll see this blue text that prompts you to actually configure the extension. So right here, this blue button configure, I click that and this blue window opens up with environment variables and you see it's asking for a reCAPTCHA secret key. So how to get that? we just read these installation instructions, which tell us to get uh, both a secret key and a site key from Google reCAPTCHA and how to do that. The first step just being go to the reCAPTCHA homepage, click on the admin console, and then go to the dashboard, click the plus button uh, to create a new reCAPTCHA, and then just fill out the relevant information uh, to create a reCAPTCHA type. Once you do that, um, you can just copy and paste both the site key and secret key. So I'm gonna go over to the reCAPTCHA page and I'm actually already on the dashboard and I'll click on this plus button to create one as it prompts me. So for label, I'll just go ahead and put demo, reCAPTCHA type, we have the option of V3 and V2. I'm gonna do V2 because I like that I'm not a robot one, which is checked right there. And for the domain, we're actually gonna get this from uh, the demo page right here. So I have the demo open. I'm gonna go ahead and just copy that. And you know, when you're using your actual app, you would want your domain for that in there. And I don't want these slashes because this is gonna confuse the Google reCAPTCHA. Okay, got my domain name. All right, next step is just to accept the terms of service. I go ahead and click submit. And here are both my site key and secret key. So for the configuration step, I first need that secret key. I can one click copy that and I'll come back into Xano and I'll hit that blue configure button where it asks me for that variable, the reCAPTCHA secret. I'll go ahead and paste that in. I hit update and that blue text turns to green and tells us our extension is configured. So now I would go ahead and click view demo, but like you saw, I already had that window open. And this is what the demo page looks like. Um, gives us some more examples of what those actual reCAPTCHA types are. And then we can click this blue button to test it with our Xeno account and also a link to get our source code, which is really helpful. So let's go ahead and test this with our Xeno account. And on the right side, you'll see we're prompted for some more information. Uh, first is that Xeno base URL, which is, can actually be found in our Xeno API groups and also that site key. So let me get that site key first from reCAPTCHA. I'll go back here. And this top one says copy site key. I'll just click that to one click copy it. Come back to the demo, paste it at the bottom. And now for that Xano base URL. So I'll come back into Xano, go to my API page where my API groups are. And this reCAPTCHA API group was created once I installed that extension. So I'll click into here. And on the right, you'll find this base request URL. So I can click this button to one click copy it. And I'll come back to my demo and where it's asking for the Xano base URL. I will just paste that in, hit update settings, and I'll be taken to this page where I can actually test this out. So it's asking me for some uh, sample field text. So I can just say hello and I can check this box. I'm not a robot that I'm sure you've all seen on websites before and it confirms I'm not a robot. So I can go ahead and hit submit and it says successful. So I successfully use the Google reCAPTCHA uh, with Xano as my backend.